Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. I'm going to be doing our daily bread haul. So before we begin, I'd like to tell everybody, how, welcome. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So I've been taking it easy, you know, just a couple days here and there. But I have to get back into my scripture writing, so that will happen tomorrow. Um... June 4th. I'm going to try to do it today, but if I can't get it uploaded by today because of my internet, I will definitely have it uploaded by tomorrow. So let's begin with the Our Daily Bread. Again, give it a big thumbs up. I don't even know why I just clapped my hands. Maserati, really? So yeah, give it a big thumbs up if you like this kind of video. So I get excited when I get Happy Mail and I open it right away. I use, I would love to do an unboxing where I tear it open in front of you. But it seems like it's not going to happen. So again, I got two packages from Our Daily Bread. They sent them separately. I have more I have to mail out to get more books. But I mean, I love this stuff. This is like what gets me. So they send an envelope just in case you want to donate. And this is free, completely free shipping. Um, they send you a card and you mail it right back. You do have to put a stamp, which is fine. And yeah, so that is that. And they sent me three of the same ones. So again, if anybody's interested in one of these, this one's a little damaged. And I have a, you know, like I have them in like pretty much all my planners. But yeah, I will, I'll probably just keep that one. But I do have two that I can mail out. So if you're interested, it just says, Do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I love that. Hopefully you can see that, because it is kind of dark. I just got off of work really super late, so I could not film today until I got you know home, which is what, like 9 o'clock tonight? So just bear with me. I'm a little tired. I did a long shift. So the first book I opened up, and if you can feel the buttery smooth of this book, oh my gosh. This is the Moment of Peace. What did I just put on here? Okay, there we go. Moments, and then it sticks. Moments of Peace for Moms. I love this. And it says 365 Daily Devotions from our daily bread and again once again it is free i wish i had my ruler in front of me because i would tell you what the size is of this book it is almost the size of my hand my hand is a little bit bigger my fingers but if you look there you go so this is a very small yet it's the size of this paper pretty much the paper is a little bit bigger See? So it's on the end, correct? There you go, so you can see it. Side to side is the same size. So this is pretty cool. So it says moments again, not again, moments of peace for moms. Again, on the spine, gives you a little bit of information. Again, this book is completely free, so you're not going to get a barcode. Um... Where did I find, oh my gosh, was it in my, oh no, it's in the back of here. I'm going to give you the information so you can order one. There is two more books out there that I need to get for here. But let's do a little quick flip to show you what it looks like in the inside. So when you open it up, it says again, the title, Our Daily Bread. Then you get a break for mom. This is like the copyright information. There you go, so you can see it. So do you get scripture in here as well? I know in the t in the front you do. Okay, so it's just about mom. And then it goes Proverbs 31, 10, 25 through 31, January 1st. So it's like, it's kind of dated, but not like for the year. So it's saying do this one January 1st. You don't have to do that. You can do it whenever you pick this up or whatever speaks to you in here. So this one's like, just to give you an example, influence of godly mothers. Listen, my son, to your fathers. Instruction 
And do not forsake your mother's teaching. Proverbs 1 8. And again, it gives you Proverbs 31 10, 25 through 31. And then you'll hear, I mean, you hear. Then it's like training rules 1, 2, 3, 4. So, yeah, this is pretty interesting. And it's just a day on a page, which is pretty cool. Safe and still. And again, Psalms 91. And then 91 1. Comforter by God. He carries us. Be still, my soul. Don't forget yourself. So it just goes on. Every month, you'll see a new one. Or every day, you'll see a new one. And then on the bottom, it has like JYDB. I think those are the authors and the ones that written, you know, that wrote this. So I'll show you that in a second. But if you just flip, you will see like here, September 24th, October. If you want, oh, look at this one. We need to speak up. If you want your marriage to sizzle with love in your loving cup, when wherever, whenever you're wrong, admit it. Whenever you're right, shut up. <laughs> Can we shut up as we're saying we're right? You would hope so, but sometimes we don't. So I'm trying to get to the back so I can show you what the back looks like. So we can move on to the next book. Okay, so these are the two books. Okay, so this one's God Hears Her, and then God Sees Her. And they're both 365-day devotional. So if you're interested in it, go to visit God's her. Visit God hers. My God, I can't speak. Visit visit God hears her dot org. So here we go. Just screenshot it. And it's again from our daily bread. And in the back here, if I can get to the last page. And the beginning of this page. Okay, so I'm not even close. Okay. So, like the JB is James Banks. So these are the writers that wrote, you know, in here, ABP, uh, JB again, uh, DR, RD. Those are the initials to the writers. And then you get a bunch of pages of that because there's a bunch of writers, of course. So you'll have a bunch of pages of those. And then in the back here, this is the contact information. So anytime you want to get something from Our Daily Bread, go on to Our Daily Bread. You could pick up another copy to give as a gift, share a link to the book, or mention it on social media, write a review on your blog, recommend this book for your church, book club, or small group. Um, yeah. So these are the Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. That's their website. I mean, well, that's their website or email, but that's their uh, location. Okay, so you have all that information. And then again, the back of the book. I love this book. It is so little. It's so cute. Okay, so again, envelope just in case you want to donate. And I just literally tore into it. It's kind of like how I roll. I like to get my books. So the next one is a really nice one too. So then I got one of these and I have so many. So if somebody's interested, leave a comment. They did send it a little bit uh, bent. But I'm sure if you're putting it in your planner or something. See right here it's bent and right here. That's how it came in. I don't know if you can see the bent. And down here. But if you're interested in having these, just let me know. And again, they give you another envelope just in case you want to donate. And again, that's how they base their money off of is donations. So the next one is 100 Prayers Inspired by Their Psalms. <clears throat> by the Psalms. By Julie Ackerman Link. And again, it's the spine. The back of the book so this one has a upc but it is again our daily bread and then it has a little bit of psalms david and the psalmist so it's a little information back here 
a little bit about jewelry. And if you see the book, look at how shiny this book is. This part feels good, and then this part feels weird. Especially when you get down here, it feels a little weird. I'm not gonna lie, but look at how cute that is. So when you flip the book, let's see what's in the first page. A hundred prayers. Like that. Another title. So this one has to George H. O. Oban? O. Man? Oban? And that's J.R. Link. And then you have the contents. So the introduction. And there is a hundred, so it's going to be a lot. So then here's an introduction of how it all began. And then goes into... I have no idea. Doesn't have a title. So it says, Oh Lord, you have searched me, and you know me. You know when I sit and when I... And when rise, you perceive my thoughts from afar. And then it just keeps going. But it has like Psalms 139, 1-2, which is here. 5-6, which is here. 14, 17, and 23 and 24. And the NIV of 1984. Sorry if this book is crooked. It's the way I'm holding it. So the first one is Search Me, O God. So again, you have... Search me, O God, and know my heart. So it has a scripture. Psalms 139, 23, NIV, 1984. And then it just has, you know, the information. But this is... Oh, and then it has this in the back. So is it like one... I have no idea how this goes. Because it's like the majesty of your name. And then in the back, it has scripture to follow, I'm assuming. Rise up and sing, which says Psalms ten sixteen, and then it has like a disc, you know, like a story, and then Psalms sixteen one through two, five eleven, and then Psalms seventeen fifteen. So I'll have to look into this and see like what is this about, but it is a hundred prayers inspired by Psalms. I like this. It came to handy. Oh my God, sorry. I'm so tired. Like, oh, I'm ready to knock out. So here's 100. I love how simple this looks. So the index of Psalms. And then in the back. Uh, I think I'm, I feel like I'm missing a page. Yes. Okay. A word about Julie Ackerman, the link. Not the link. I guess her last name is Link. I don't know why I keep adding words. And then it's about our daily bread. So again, pick up another copy. Blah, blah. I was going to say blah, 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 but I'm just tired. And then in the back of that is blank. Just some no pages. And then that is it. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe. And again, before I finish that, I tore this one open too. So yeah, I can never wait. So again, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give this video a big thumbs up. Leave a comment and share the video. These are really cute books and they're totally free. But if you do want to like donate again there's envelopes for that um if you have any questions please leave them in the comments below thank you for watching thank you for being patient with me just trying to recoup you know my health back which i'm not there yet and my daughter ended up having covid again so i don't know it's just one thing after another so yeah so thank you for watching and i will talk to you in the next video and again, if you're interested in these cards, like, they're not cards, they're like paper, cardstock kind of. So if you're interested in them, leave them in the comments below. And I have our Daily Bread books that nobody has claimed, it looks like. Um, I don't know where I put them. They're not in front of me. 
I wish they were so I could show it to you. But yeah, so if you're interested in those, the it's kind of like this one here, but smaller. So it's like this, but smaller. This one's April, May, and June. I have the July, August, and September, I believe. Or it could be June, July, and August. Either way, they're the small ones, kind of like a little bit smaller than this, I think. And if you're interested in it, again, leave a comment. And, you know, I can mail it out to you. Probably with one of these. So again, thank you for watching. And I will talk to you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know which, um, which book you know, seems interesting to you. And if you understand this book or if you have this book, let me know like why is it the back side that and the opposite side is something else. So again, thank you for watching. Talk to you in the next one. Bye bye.